Hey, what's up, everybody? Gonna hop on here, do a quick uh, review demonstration here of the LED night lights with the uh, dust to dawn sensor that I just picked up. It's a two two pack. Uh, I've got two daughters that are just getting uh, getting kind of used to get uh, sleeping without a big night light, and um, they're starting to sleep in darker rooms, but they still aren't quite there where they want a where they want a completely dark room yet. So, figured pick this up as an intermediary. I have two daughters. It was a two pack when they showed up. I pulled one out of here to test it out already. And um, there's essentially not much to these lights other than the fact that you kind of plug them in, uh, set the set the brightness dim or bright, and then uh, just kind of let the sunlight and let night do its thing. What I've done here to try to do a demonstration is I've also uh, I've ran an extension cord here to my nice little uh, camera setup so we can kind of see how this works. But obviously you put it in there, and because I have all the studio lights and everything on, it's not going to uh, not going to fire. But this is a very sensitive sensor. So if there's any, I mean, like, any bit of disruption in light. I mean, I have all the studio lights on, and I'm still able to trigger this coming on and off. So uh, this may may stay lit during the day. I'm not sure. I'll uh, I'll run this for a couple of days, and we'll see. Or if you've got, or if you've got an area that gets a lot of sunlight, it might work. Um, but yeah, this is uh, it's a it's a really. I don't know if the camera's gonna be able to pick that up. So let me turn on some of the lights here. Some of the filming lights. And yeah, there we go. So I turned off those lights. I turned off the lights in the room. This is a very bright light. So it's, even though it's small, it will give off a lot in the room. And that, oh, that's actually the brightest setting. So if we bring it down here to the not bright setting, I'll try to get the camera on here. But you'll see the difference in the light. So simple, effective, neat little, uh, neat little light. And again, if you're looking for something inexpensive and you're looking for a pair and something that's kind of sensitive and it's not, you know, fully on, fully off, this isn't a bad little purchase. So I will recommend it. Hey, real quick, if you like what you see in this video and you want to purchase one for yourself, I've left links to everything here in the description. And if you want more no nonsense, no BS product reviews, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel and hit the uh, hit the bell so you don't miss one.